Drake, Drake is a he's a rapper. He's pretty popular. I think the only reason why Drake is so popular is because he has really good delivery. You know, like Drake can say something that makes no sense whatsoever. But just the fact that he delivered it so well make everybody applaud him, you know? Like, he come on the track, he be like, oh, that look like what's her name? Chances are it is what's her name. She came through with some pancakes, then after that gave her a handshake. Like, what? <laughs> she came through with some pancakes? After that you gave her a handshake? Oh, dog, that's gangster, dog. Uh, you know? And Drake, Drake is getting real cocky now. He's real cocky. All of his lyrics talk about what he got. He got a lyric, he goes, how you feel, how you feel, how you feel? 25 sitting on? 25 Yes. 25 sitting on 25 mil. If I wrote that song, that lyric would be totally different if it was my truth, right? I come on like, how you feel, how you feel, how you feel? 25 living at my mama house still. Swag. Uh, uh. Yeah. I'm in my bedroom and I'm feeling myself sleeping in all day, pay rent, no way, don't you, you feel me? All day, you know? But Drake, Drake is so cocky, he gets to the point where he does this thing, right? He would say a lyric and he would think the lyric was so brilliant, he would take a step back and go, ah, ah. Otherwise saying, I delivered that punchline so perfectly, dog. ah, Drake. Everybody do that, everybody go, ah. Everybody, you in the back go, ah. Next time in life, when you do something, you feel like you did it perfectly, and you couldn't have done it any better, just take a step back and be like, ah. I did the other day. I was driving down the street, and I was extremely intoxicated, and a cop pulled me over. He's like, sir, you've been swerving and doing all this stuff. Have you been drinking? I was like, no, officer, I have not been drinking. He goes, okay, well, get home safe. I was like, thank you. Ah. Ah. Psych them, dog. Ah. Psych. And then uh, you got Lil Wayne, man. Like, Lil Wayne is a rapper that can get away with stuff that no other rapper could ever get away with. Like, you listen to like a 16 bar Lil Wayne verse, right? Now, the first eight bars of the 16 bar verse will be him rapping something pretty clever. But then the second eight bars will be just him laughing at what he previously just said. You know? He be like, and after we got done, I said, lady, what's your number? She said, 911. <laughs> Lil Wayne, yeah, baby. Yeah, we said, baby. Oh, I'm still rapping. Yeah. You know? Don't you hate it when you listen to the radio and like a cool beat come on? You're like, man, I like this beat. Who gonna rap over this beat? But it turned out to be some whack, corny, like commercial for some product you would never use in your life, you know? Like the beat come on, it's like. Oh, I like this. I'll turn this up, turn this up. Then a voice come on, you can tell it's a white guy. He's like, 888, get bailed. 888, get bailed. 888, get bailed. We hold the key to get you out of jail, dog. Like, no. You don't hold the key to get me out of jail. Like, you never hear any hip hop commercials on the radio for any actual legit companies, okay? You never hear like a Clorox bleach hip hop commercial on the radio. We got that Clorox bleach for y'all. Clorox bleach for y'all. Clorox bleach for y'all. We'll get the doodle stains out your drawer. Swag. I know. You don't hear that. Okay? You never hear like a Liz Crafters glasses commercial that use hip hop on the radio. We got those Liz Crafters all day. Liz Crafters all day. Liz Crafters all day. See big titties from a mile away. Yeah, I know. You don't see that. You know what I mean? <laughs> you never hear like a, an H&R Block Texas hip hop commercial on the radio, all right? H&R Block, get your taxes right. H&R Block, get your taxes right. H&R Block, get your taxes right. And don't end up like, what's this? <laughs> uh, I said it. No. But then one thing about the radio is like, they have a celebrity voiceover, right? And if celebrity's trying to sell a product, but it's always the wrong celebrity trying to sell the wrong product. Like, why are you, you know, come on now, you know, come on. What the, why are you trying to sell this, you know? Like the, the, the dude come on, he's like, hi. When I wake up in the morning, I wash my face with Proactive to get my skin soft, clean, and luscious. So when I get in front of the camera, my skin is smooth like a baby's bottom. <laughs> this is Seal signing out. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Seal? 
What the hell? It's racist, man. That's racist. 